physical touch You my rocket, you my perfect picture Baby, you know I'm tryna kick it with ya Ain't gotta wait till it gets dark We get 106 and park, you be my rock, I be your big tigger I'm tryna show you off, I'm tryna flaunt ya I'm obsessed with ya, baby, I want ya Let them watch ya, tell them they can tune in Show them how I put our love on a bill Hi guys, and welcome back to another vlog It's officially 2021 and this is my first video of the year I just needed a break from YouTube for a little bit, but now I'm back and we're back to our vlogs today is Yeah, it's Friday the 8th 1037 in the morning and I just finished getting ready and I am just about to get dressed. I did my hair and makeup I actually did a little blowout yesterday. I figured it is Start of a new year and I just wanted to feel good. So <laughs> my hair is not up for once. I did a little blowout. I probably won't be doing this probably for another like two months. Um, this is as much effort as I'll give my hair for the beginning of 2021. Um, yeah, so I did a little blowout home, which takes me forever because I have so much hair, but I feel like it looks fine and I just sleep on it and I don't really like touch it up until um, I wash it and then restyle it, so. It's kind of what I did last night and I just did my hair. I also have self tanner on so if I look a little bit more tan than usual that is why. I'm definitely so pale right now. I am not naturally this tan. I just have self tanner on. So I'm about to get dressed and I'm actually going to head out and catch up with one of my good friends. We're getting um, I think coffee and lunch at this really cute cafe that I've been meaning to check out just haven't had the chance to go yet. Um, so we're gonna go do that and probably just walk around and hang out. It's Friday and it's kind of, it looks really sunny outside. I think it's freezing, but it's, at least it's sunny. So I'm gonna bundle up, but I'm excited that it's sunny outside and makes the day feel so much better and we're productive. So that's kind of the plan. I know there's so much going on right now with the pandemic and kind of the political scene and every, I'm sure you guys are all aware of what the craziness going on so it's just been a wild wild week keeping up with the news i was just watching the news right now and i just turned it off because i'm like i can't there's like so much going on it's so intense but i'm so excited to be back on youtube i love you guys i hope everybody had a good holiday season considering the current circumstances um i hope everybody was safe and had a great time and is excited for 2021 and hopefully we see some light at the end of the tunnel some point this year so that we can all um, feel a lot better. So it's 1040, I'm about to get dressed and get ready. Probably have a little snack. <laughs> I'm gonna have a little snack before I go eat more with my friend. <laughs> That's so me. Just need to look out your window. Show the whole city I'm all yours. Let me put us on display, yeah. I shot it from the rooftops, I got a Jump out of a window if you call me Yeah Touch your name on my neck, I promise Girl, I swear I'm obsessed I whatever you want, girl It's no problem Your love's my drug and I'm obsessed with you Yeah Need to look out your window. Show the whole city I'm all yours. Let me put us on display.
the break after the bend How much farther will we fall And I'll wait for us to land Still suspended, it's still dark When I looked over my plans This wasn't there, yeah, here we are You're the break after the bend How much farther will we fall How much farther can we Before, no more help down here to call Push and pull and pull some more Where's the bottom of these walls? There's no never-ending war How much farther will we fall? How much farther can we fall? <laughs> mm, so good Christian is bringing us some sunshine with the color he has going on. I'm obviously wearing all black. You're a little spring today. A bit. We approve. Love that for us. I literally show up and Christian has a baguette for me with cheese and then we got some brie and we got some salami and meats and stuff. And uh, Christian's on keto again for the new year. Yeah, so the cheese and the salami, that part's for me. <laughs> The baguette. The baguette's all me. The butter. <laughs> I'll take you could do a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> you could do a little bit of the butter. Coffee. It's so funny. That's how you know you have a good friend. When you show up and they get you a whole baguette because they know I love fucking bread and butter. He's a keeper. <laughs> with everybody 
just got home and I'm chugging a bunch of water because I feel so dehydrated. We didn't really drink water when we were hanging out. So I'm about to actually hop on emails because I have some work to catch up on since I've been gone all day. And then I have some packages to send out and I'm probably gonna take Prince to the dog park to play a little bit because he seems like he has a lot of energy. I just got home and he is like wild right now. So that is kind of the plan for the rest of the day. Um, probably make more food because I'm really, <laughs> I'm actually really hungry. Um, I did not eat that whole baguette, by the way, if you guys are wondering. We had a little bit and then we gave the rest <laughs> to these birds that were in the park next to us. Um, so yeah, <laughs> that's kind of what happened to the baguette, but we ate everything else. I had like two coffees. I had the chai latte and then I got a coffee to go. I got like a regular latte to go um, when we were walking around and then we just walked around in Soho for a little bit and then I came home. So I'm gonna do a little bit of work right now. I'll probably make a little snack finish up all that stuff and maybe go, I think I'm actually gonna go get some wine too so we can have some wine and watch a movie tonight. Really chill rest of the night. So that's that. So I am actually about to take off my makeup and you guys ask me all the time if I could do a skincare routine And I promise I have one coming. My lip liner is like all messed up now I haven't done it since this morning. I just had like I noticed I had like a huge line at the top of my lip Anyways, so I'm gonna do a skincare routine. I promise it's coming up in a video I'm gonna do my morning and nighttime skincare, but I figured I'd just show you some of the products right now um, yeah, so I have makeup on today, so I'm gonna Change up my cleanser if I'm not wearing makeup I do a different cleanser, but it, since I am wearing makeup I'm doing a cleanser that removes makeup. So it's a little bit stronger and I've been using the beauty counter coconut cleanser cocoa cream cleanser Love this one. So I'll do this to take off my makeup and then let's see I after my um cleanser how I know what I'm gonna put on my skin depends on what I used the night before. So if I use like a stronger uh, product with like more acids then, um, or exfoliants, then today I would do something lighter and vice versa. And then some days I just don't put anything on my face at night so that my skin can actually rest because that's also really, really good for your skin to just kind of like leave it bare and like let it breathe. Um, so it's not good to always have product on it, but then when you do have product on it, just make sure you're picking the right products. So yesterday, what did I have on my skin yesterday? I don't even remember. Okay, uh, oh, actually I think I had self-tanner last night, so I didn't have anything on my skin except self-tanner. So I didn't put anything on my skin. So today I want to exfoliate a little bit since I have my self-tanner, so I'm gonna use the Good Jeans by Sunday Riley, which I love, and my eye cream by Paracone. This is the CBD one I was showing you guys earlier. Yeah, soothing and hydrating eye cream with CBD. And then my Glow Recipe lip balm. And that's it. Really simple for the night. Just using my um, Good Jeans under eye cream and lip balm. That's pretty much it. So I'm about to wash my face and get ready for bed. And I'll see you guys in a second. I've got a cold heart, cold hands. 
Watching my makeup, I remember that I promised you guys I would speak Bulgarian in my next vlog. And I'm like, crap, I'm about to end my vlog. So I figured I'd just do a quick snippet in here. And I do speak Bulgarian fluently for those of you that were asking me. Um, I can't write Bulgarian because I moved to the States when I was uh, seven. I was in first grade. Um, so I just finished first grade and then I moved to the States. So I really didn't learn or remember how to write, but I know how to read. If I read slowly, I can read things in Bulgarian and then I know how to speak the language fluently. So, uh, um, Може би, че аз не говоря перфектно български и вие сигурно ще видите това веднага, но българския съм... Нали, като живея в България, говорих български много ясно, ама а, като не знаех английски, като се преместих в Америка, като бех на 7 години, а, нали, веднага научих английски и така през това време малко забър... забървих българския. Но винаги съм говорил, говорила на български с моето семейство и заради това знам как, как да говоря български, но нали не знам 100% всичко и някои думи още не знам. Но мога нали, да се разбирам с хората като говоря по България. И да, не знам друго какво да кажа. Ако имате нали, специални въпроси, може да ме питате. Но аз сега ще си лягам. Принцът тук е до мен готов да си лягаме и лао. Аз съже много обичам да говоря. Мами тати викат българ, българово английски. Говоря на български и на английски по едно и също време, защото някои, българи, а, някои думи ми идват по-бързо на английски, някои думи ми идват по-бързо на български. Говоря двете в един същи сентенц, както ето сега права. Но моите родители ме разбират, защото те знаят български и английски. Но като го ходя в България, по някой път се изпускам и кажа някои думи на английски, да мога да се разбереме. Но те са свикнали, мое семейство е свикнало. И така, добре, не знам друго какво да кажа. Това е до сега. Чао! Обичам ви всички от България. And that is it for all my English speakers. Um, you probably had no idea what I just said, but I pretty much just had a little chat in Bulgarian. And yeah, that is it. I'm about to go to bed. I love you all. See you in the next vlog. Bye.